Okay, C. Linda Law video, C. I. Inspire Cast, Finding the Intersection of Circles. I had somebody contact me through comments today and ask me how to solve this problem. So I did the whole thing by hand. And I was like, damn, there's got to be an easier way. And this is the easier way using your calculator. So check this out, please. I'm going to go to the home screen right here is the red button. From here, obviously, I'm going to choose graphs. From graphs, got to be careful because this is the function line. So you couldn't enter a circle here. But what you can do is you can go to the menu and where it says graph, enter your edit. You just go to this, open it. And then equation templates is what you want. Choose circle. So here it is. And the, my first circle is x minus 2, x minus 2 squared plus, plus y is it minus 3, minus 3 squared. This is super, super important that this is not going to let you put in radius squared. That is to say, if it's not going to put in, you can't put in 9. If you put in 9, you're going to get 9 squared. So if you meant 9, you have to put in 3. 3 squared is 9. I know it sounds silly for me to say it, but somewhere, someplace where people get actually get caught on this jump. So there is our first circle. Going to do the same thing again. Just going to go back here. Going to go to graph entry. Going to choose equations. I'm going to go to circle. The first one is the one I want. The second one was x minus 1. Tab over. But this one is a little bit different because I, I want, for this circle that this person gave me, they wanted y plus 1. So I have to put in negative 1 here. Hopefully you can see this right here, that this is multiplication of signs here. So a negative times a negative is a positive, which gives me y plus 1 here. Same thing, they wanted 16, whoa, they wanted 16, but 16 is 4 squared. Hit enter. Check this out. We are done with this. We are done. All we have to do now is find these intersections, and it's super easy because we're just going to go back to the menu screen. I'm going to go back to the menu screen, and all I'm going to do is analyze a graph. From analyze, we're, we're looking for intersection, and all we're going to do is put a dot here. So I'm going to left click here, and then I'm going to drag. And there is our first intersection. There's our first intersection. And I'm going to go back here and do the same thing again. I'm going to analyze the graph. I'm going to look for the intersection. I'm going to go to the left hand side of that intersection. Drop a dot and just drag that joint over. Hit enter. Boom. Got it done in two minutes, 32 seconds. Hope this was helpful. If you have questions or comments, please let me know. You know I do respond. And also, if you haven't already subscribed, would you do that for me? Please.